Hello everyone. In this lecture today, I'm going to talk to you about the difference between autotroph and heterotrophs. Okay. So if you look at this word autotroph, it consists of two words or it is basically derived from two Greek words. One is auto and the other is troph. Auto means self. Okay. Auto means self and troph means feeding or nourishment. Okay. Auto means self whereas trough means fe feeding or nourishment. That means that these organisms make their own food from simple substances. Okay, so autotrophs, they make their own food from simple substances. So now if you look at this word heterotrophs, hetero it means other. Okay, hetero it means other and trough it means feeding or nourishment. Okay, feeding or nourishments. That means these organisms or heterotrophs, they depend on autotrophs for food. Heterotrophs, they depend on others or simply autotrophs for food. Autotrophs, they make their own food, whereas heterotrophs, they depend on autotrophs for food. Second difference is, the difference is that since autotrophs, they make food, they are called producers as they make food required by other organisms. Autotrophs are called producers whereas heterotrophs are called consumers because they consume food prepared by autotrophs or they simply consume autotrophs in a food chain autotrophs they make of the first trophic level okay in a food chain autotrophs they make the first trophic level whereas heterotrophs uh, form the next trophic levels after plants in the food chain and the final difference is that plants, algae and some bacteria are examples of autotrophs whereas most animals, fungi and some bacteria are example of heterotrophs. Thank